Star we Trek, the original series, uh, <laughs> season two, episode 26, Assignment Earth is over and has been since 1968 and may or may not, of course, with the moon landing. We'll get into it. I'm Dave Mater, coming at you at Star Trek TV movie reviews here for Wednesday, Ted Trek original series. Your assignment was Assignment Earth to watch Assignment Earth. And we're going to break that all down. Uh, and last, we have Adam Woodward. How are you doing tonight, Adam? I'm good. I really like this episode. Jody. No one asked. <laughs> I, I'm so aggravated by this. It's not even funny. Like I, I did, and no disrespect to anybody on the panel, but oh, okay. <laughs> starting like that, we got it. But come on, like in what f world is this a good show? In what oh, world is this good. Star Trek? If oh. I'm gonna sit down and watch Star Trek, I want my f characters from Star Trek. I don't want some f***ing Sabrina the Teenage Witch f***ing cat running around. I don't want some cat? asshole who thinks he's Max from f***ing Get Smart. Like, Why is um, Spock thinking he's in like a 90s like pop band? Yeah, like, you know, he, like he looks like he should there? be running oh, for I Big Sugar. He looks like he's the lead singer of New Radicals. <laughs> You only get what you give. <laughs> yeah, they spend a lot of time in suits and, and trench coats in this episode. Just like, okay, this Gary Seven character is interesting, I think. I like that maybe that's my only redeeming thing here because he's he's using what's kind of like a sonic screwdriver. Yes, he is. And that last but, week. But this is actually before Doctor Who was using a sonic screwdriver because they didn't use it till the third Doctor, and this is before that. So this is kind of so he, he, it feels a little bit like Doctor Who. He kind of feels like Get Smart, I guess, a little bit in like this secret right. agent sense, but he less not like a buffoon like Get Smart. Sorry, where am I going, Jody? Is there You're going nowhere because that's I'm going what this nowhere. Is. Yeah, this is this is no. What, what, what are original, you guys doing here? Come on, is this a practical point. joke? Like, am I on some sort of show? <laughs> I, I honestly don't understand why you guys like this episode. I just don't get it. I lower your standards a little bit, maybe. <laughs> I already lowered my standards. I watched this thing. You, you, you'd be the guy at a baseball game in 1968 video saying, "I want a 2020 uh, cameras." Yeah, no, you're baseball. missing the whole point on what I'm trying to say, Ted. I have <laughs> I have no problem with the plot. I have no problem with the whole archival footage things because they're literally playing on what's happening at the moment. Because at right. the moment when this episode came out, this was the big deal, right? Yeah. I totally get it, and I would have loved to live in that yeah. time period for that. Uh, it's it's everything else in this episode. The fact that it's not really Star Trek. Like this looks like yeah. it was literally written by somebody who doesn't know anything about Star Trek. They're like, oh, there's really? these space guys, and they're in this thing that looks like a saucer, and then they're going to save things. Say that everybody's got to open their mind to, uh, like, it, it's not all the same. You know what, all... Ted? With with all due respect, no, I don't need to open my goddamn right. mind on every one of these episodes. Every, every episode was the same. We wouldn't be having this this um, communication here. Oh, I completely yeah. agree with you on that, but I, so, but so just because they're, no, I disagree totally with everything you say, and <laughs> your, your, your points make no points. I'm going to go out on a limb here and tell you you're an idiot. Oh, okay. Oh, bringing the hot fire. No sense. I thought this was a hell of a good episode. I watched the whole damn thing twice <laughs> in the last two weeks, and I was excited. <laughs> I watched it again. It was so damn good. So what you're saying is full of shit. Yeah. There. I think I beat. All right. Is that time to go to fun facts or is um, I well, guess sure. I've been we told can to, we can go to double F. Beam me aboard. Energize. Energizing. 